hopefully be back. <clears throat> If you can see the same again. Erica. <clears throat> you like right, back on the roof again. Because I didn't save that, so there we go. Yes, we are back again. Stream starting off. Right. That. Get me. Okay, let's go and have a look. Actually, it's nice that it. Um. And have a look at the float. Hi McGreedy, are you stuck? You didn't make it to the gate. <laughs> I just walked down the side of the street. Do, 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 do. Here we go. So the throne, yes, it's from New World. Um, and as I was saying, been something of a Bob Ross. He's very good at painting. So, uh, he tries to pick up good paint brushes, glue, duct tape, you know, you got to fix the frames up. He's a very handy man actually. He's a trained engineer, but he's also an artist. So. It's just if you want anything making, just go and ask Vin. You'll probably be able to make it unless you want sewing done, in which case don't ask Vincent to sew. Ask McCready because I think McCready can sew. He just hasn't had time to fix his coat, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so I found you when it's you quiet. need your so holes in your socks mended. Yeah, yeah, old long for you know, McCready for new socks. Um, it's quiet, too quiet, McCready, is it? Yeah, it's too quiet on the stream. We need more people. Um, well, we'll keep streaming and we'll we'll raid in Bethesda in an hour with however many people we manage to get. Anyway, pretty Halloween lights from the new set. And so you will see this hopefully at some point. <laughs> I submitted a 20 second video because that's that's the only man we could have if we weren't being interviewed. So there'll be a lot of little 20 second bits. Um, so it goes by fast. So I wanted the opportunity beforehand to give people a good look at um, at the whole float that I put effort into. <laughs> So please stand by, this is a modern art piece. Yeah, that Vincent didn't do that one. Uh, there is something actually here to represent all the factions as well. Don't talk to Vincent about the lantern. Just just leave that subject alone, okay? Yeah. <clears throat> yes, Minutemen and Brotherhood. I I did finish the game with the Brotherhood, but he's very much sided with the Minutemen. Um, I do like this painting quite a lot. The abstract one. I felt that was a bit brotherhoody. Happy! Captain McCready's nickname. Bottle is Vincent's nickname. <laughs> and uh, some colour sort of effect there. And the Minutemen represented. And of course we had to represent comic art as well because that's that's kind of a nod to my drawing as well as the, not that I do comics but I I've over the past couple of years I've really started to get into doing digital art and doing commissions for people um and it's a lot of fun and I just loved the comics in the game fabulous first issue your favorite heroes together for the first time no evil can withstand the might of the unstoppable and that's also another one of Vincent's swimmer um, and you could call it of course so that's kind of my nod to graphic design 
art as well. I nearly went into graphic design, but I ended up uh, doing 3D design instead at art college. I did. Uh, did you? Yeah. I ended up in um, what's called design representation, which doesn't really have a job attached to it, but it's sort of how to take des how to design like like music model. That was basically model making. Anyway, beyond the float, there is a gallery that my mum has named because I said, I was trying to explain a little bit about my character. <laughs> I said that he, he really enjoyed painting. She likes painting, she likes art. And I said, what could I call my gallery? I said, he's, he's a man sort of frozen out of time. And um, and she said, how about a brush with time? And I was like, that's perfect. Mm -hmm. So, welcome to the art gallery. It's open for perusal. Um, now, when I built it, Codsworth was in here and he was behind that counter. And since I've built it, he moved and won't go back in there. But he, he is the curator, actually. Codsworth is now the curator. So, we've got... Well, boxing glove. It's a little bit of museum piece there. Vincent liked boxing. He wasn't as good at it as his cousin was. Um, Cat and Bunny Baby, you might know the name Vaughn Zander because I've reposted it. So that's uh, since character. Vaughn was better at boxing. Sorry? Who? I didn't really hear you. Vaughn Zander is a great active since character um, and I just saw him of him one day on Tumblr and I went, he could be related to my character and I got in touch with the person and they said yeah let's do that let's make them relate we loads of back little two of them um, very very different from each other personality wise but um, brother so we've got a little that's, that's not my phone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is my phone. I feel like this should be a plaque with something on it. Glad that's behind me. I would say an art gallery is a far cry from working with it's peaceful, isn't it? Yeah, I just I love painting. Lake mountain and trees. Very peaceful. And then this I like to think this is by Duncan McCree because um, this Halloween cat was on the wall of the house and when I put the painting up it flipped through so I thought you know what that's perfect let's make this an old painting which is damaged in the corner as you can see it's, there's a hole there and let's say let's say Duncan's painted this cat this scary cat on it <laughs> so that's his and there's kitties there and puppies and <clears throat> he's there that's kitty corner um and uh, yes, you can you can rent space in the art gallery and get your own hung for a while. Uh, we've got light. So this is like a water theme wall, and then inside here we got oh, more of the water theme. Inside here we've got the restoration area, and of course we've got the top picture. <laughs> I had to put one in. Um, yeah, this is, this is the corner of the shower used to be. <laughs> Modern art gallery. Again, things clipped through, and I thought this was quite fun. Because now you can see the skeleton through the painting there. So yeah, rather enjoyed that. Um, let's say there's nothing in the second. So some really interesting pieces. I quite like this one. I like the colours in this one. So what do you go for when you decorate up for? Is it do you have a like a building style spend a long time on places or do you just put down what you need to play the game and, and move on quickly? I I crush the game. You cried. 
I have on my PlayStation 4. <laughs> made my vault too big, and every time I loaded into it, it crashed because it couldn't handle it anymore. <laughs> Older then. <laughs> yeah. To be fair, my favourite way to play is with being on PC as Sim Settlements. Not yeah. having to like build everything by myself. Oh. I still get to design it, but they get to do the hard work. <laughs> yeah, I never, I've never tried the Sim Settlements. So I don't know what it's like. Really. I've never seen anybody play it. Um, well, King Gaff, the, the one that made it, was basically fed up of having to like make it, like decorate all the houses, so it was his way of uh, okay. making a system to do it, and then it ended up becoming this like, huge module. Ah, so. uh, okay. Cool. So I've... I've glazed the outsides, this is all... You know, the light comes through very nicely here. <laughs> Holes in the wall. Are these all? I think the the original design of house that the sanctuary houses are based on is a real life design called a look. I think it's a look sort of house, and it's all metal paneling, a lot of prefab stuff. Um, we've got boats. And uh, one more. Oh, the 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 gallery of faces. This is the creepiest one, I think, because it's just. I thought I'm just going to put all these creepy pictures, the cabin, of course, in this mm. tiny little space. This <laughs> make you feel really uncomfortable. I think this guy, though, he. I don't know who he's supposed to be. Whether he's actually somebody from American history. Looking at the facial hair and the shape of his face, I think it would be a very a very ancient relative of Vincent. And uh, they've got some kind of resemblance. <laughs> yeah, great, 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 great uncle, whatever. Um, so there's my lovely gallery. Very pleased as how that came out. All right, Mac. What should we do next? The house. Right. That picture you were looking at. What the? And I apologise if I have absolutely ruined the name. It's James G. Bellin. Bellin. B L A I N E. Spell that again. It's B L. Yeah. A I N E. Blaine, yep. So it's James G. Bl is it Blaine? James Blaine? G. Blaine. Blaine, yeah. Yeah. There. So that's the picture that you're looking at now. And it, was he a historical figure? Um. I shouldn't... Um. <laughs> it doesn't say. He, he was on a. It's a vintage uh, card thing, like collector's card. Okay, yeah, I, I would imagine it might be a historical figure because they do put a lot of little history nuggets in Fallout 4 for the for the area, don't they? Um, hey, Boo Parkane! There he is in chat. Hey. <laughs> right, this is Vincent Amacreed's house. Now, if we go in, um, I know we've just seen Ricky as a ghoul, but at some point, I'm afraid to say. <laughs> Just look at the screen. What's it? At some point, this uh, this postman hat. Vincent's dad used to be. Well, first he was a an army medic. He was a field medic. Um, Vincent's mum left him, and uh, he couldn't look after his kid and be in the army at the same time. So he left, and he became a postman. So he had an honourable discharge circumstances um but he became a postman and he was the most excellent postman he was the kind of postie who knew exactly where to put your parcel if you weren't in in the same place um he knew which to talk to <laughs> uh you know going to the community uh if there was a lost dog wandering down the street probably knew where it lived 
kind of thing. Um, he was just a solid chap. Anyway, here's their little sitting room. I'm very pleased. Of course, Duncan and Sean. Duncan's very shy. You won't see him. <laughs> um, <laughs> if only. If only. Um, but yeah, they've, they've got their toys all spread around a little bit. Sean loves blaster radius, I think. Um, and a little fireplace, which I'm quite proud of. My audio, you say my audio is cracking up. Yeah, that's... I, I don't know how to fix that. I do not know what to do. I don't think it's my headset, because that's fully charged. Um, I think it's just the Twitch connection tonight. So, well, I have to... Hit it with a hammer. <laughs> well, we just have to enjoy looking at the... Here should be the Twitch soldier, but guess what happened? <sighs> I pulled it in the wood, didn't I? And then made something, and it... Oh, I need ceramic, because of course the wooden top soldier is made of ceramic. Yeah, I <laughs> Yeah. Um, anyway, here's the dining room. Why is the coffee pot on the floor? Were the kids having a teddy bear's party again underneath the table? Oh, I'll deal with that later. Anyway, um, yeah, bureau. They've got places to sit. Um, <clears throat> the alien blaster. <laughs> I left the toolbox there because it's handy. And uh, Finn's kitchen. He's a really good cook. There's only space for him in here, which he probably likes. Cause I don't think he likes people interfering with what he's doing. Um, Greedy isn't a very good cook. He once gave Vincent... Um, there was dog meat in his road stew. And he made a sugar bomb breakfast with cheese powder from mac and cheese and a little drop of as well so he is a creative cook <laughs> vincent though, can like he can host a barbecue he's he's definitely a barbecue dad definitely um got the bathroom it's a bit special it's up here because bear sheep's character is carl dixon his real name apparently is Summers. Oh, Summer or Summers? Summer, I think. No, Summers, like Buffy. Yeah. Um, so, Bear Sheep's character is this actor who was in Night of the Fishman. He wasn't the Fishman. He was the, the handsome, dashing character. Um, and then we've got a little geek corner with the <laughs> Bosco mascot. Vincent used to go to DT Technical High. Um, Grognak, of course. They, they both like their comics very much. Silver Shroud costume. And here's Vin and Mac's bedroom. Oh, Marcy Long! What are you doing on our bed? Doesn't she have a fantastic hat? <laughs> what are you doing? I want to trade a few things. She looks stuck. I don't know what's going on there. Do you mind? I'm I'm sure I assigned you to a different bed, Mum. Did you get drunk, Marcy? I, like I wanted to chat. <laughs> yeah, she got drunk. You 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 ended up in the wrong house, Marcy. Go home. Go home. <laughs> she let me out of my bedroom now. Go away, Marcy. I'm stuck now. Help! <laughs> Marcy's holding me hostage. Oh, come on. Now, maybe if I sleep, actually, Vincent needs to pass out for a bit. Let's, uh, let's just sleep for an hour. She'll have gone away by then. Hopefully. Maybe. <laughs> NPCs in this never do quite what you think they should do. I'll hand oh, it to you. This place isn't you... awful. It's Thank still you. a hole, but it could be worse. You're talking about my bedroom. Why are you still in here, Marcy? <laughs> Was she here the whole time? Anyway, this is Duncan 
this little bedroom. I'm very proud of this little room. He's very cosy. He's good. He's got his thirst upper. Mr. Huggy's on the bed. We might have stolen that teddy bear from somewhere. I don't know where. He's got a special book. He's got his lunchbox, his little souvenir magnets. His cars and his little rubber alien on there. He's cute. I'm very pleased with this. And there's the, <laughs> there's the mother icon from Farb. Um, nothing to do with the children of Atom, no. I, I'm sure that Vincent carved that for him. Um, anyway, upstairs we've got through the garden. Upstairs we've got this little uh, sniper area where you can see over the sanctuary there. And uh, okay, who left the basketball on the roof? Never mind. Actually, no, who, how did that basketball get on the roof? It's supposed to be in the garden. Boys. The boys were playing it. Look at back in the garden. Um, yeah, so this is over the top of the old roof. They've got... Why is there a typewriter on the roof as well? <laughs> what? Um, they got a <laughs> junk jet, maybe? <laughs> How did that get there? I don't know. Do you settle it? Bring stuff? Dump things in places. I've no idea how that. Um, that's what it. Pretty sure it's supposed to be here, and that's, it could be something to do with the order in which things load in. So it's got a little attic space, stuff, um, ammo box, and sniper nest on the side here, so that you can get a fairly good view of that side of things. And then if you want to get a really good view of the whole place, you have to go uh, open the door, then you can get on the roof, of course. Um, then you can see over the whole sanctuary. There's the flute! Yay! And keep an eye around the back just in case there's any minor lurks or raids. You don't tend to get much in sanctuary these days. Such wood. <laughs> um, yeah, it's usually it's pretty quiet now. So, Mac, can I get downstairs, please? Thank you. <clears throat> and then at the side of the garden and at the side of the house, they've got a little patio. They can go and have some food, watch the kids playing. There's one of Dogmeat's houses. I'm not sure where Dogmeat is right now. And uh, here is the Vaughn's Anvil. So you can hang your coat up on here. Wash your hands when you come in. There's All the kids are safe. And... Um, and then all these little chairs. Those little chairs and desks. Like, two pumpkins to go collect soon. People leaving desk fans on the floor. And here is Anne Hargreaves. So, <laughs> you can assign her to a clothes shop to get a tip for clothing shop. So this, that's what this is basically, but I've um, made this into the school cafeteria this bit. I don't know if I can get round there, but yeah. Um, not serving much at the moment, are you? Never mind. I'll have to fill that up later. Oh, got a few bits and pieces in there. Mm. Oh, Ali suffered damage. And they've got a playground out the back. So we've got a bucket, we've got a car, cars, another bucket. Uh, I think you can throw a ball. Oh, that's where the ball came from. Um, and it's got the switch on it, so it'll do something every time the ball goes through the hoop. Um, yeah, turret. <laughs> Some cowboys. 
Bottle and Cappy. Some fun space posters. I just tried to make it a nice little, nice little area. And there is a gate you can go through into the uh, guard post outside, but <sighs> I've just come just come across something really awesome. What's that? It brings me back to my um, childhood. Oh. The fl the uh, flaming paper sack loot bag. <laughs> flaming paper sack loot bag. Yeah, it's on fire. <laughs> right. Um, like I say, that's, it brings back memories of setting paper bags on fire. <laughs> <clears throat> we used to have a really, really horrible person that lived down our street. She was oh. really just horrible. So we used to do the old knock on the door and run away. Uh, I see. Um. And she used to scream and shout, oh, I'm calling the police. So the more she screamed and shouted, the more <laughs> the more we did it. Um, there is. <laughs> so um, then we decided to do the old um, the dog poop in the bag. Ew. <laughs> and then um, someone told us, unfortunately, she passed away from her um, a heart attack. And we're like, oh, oh no. That wasn't my fault. <laughs> oh. <laughs> she went so grumpy. Oh, yeah. I was joking. <laughs> right, so that upstairs, that's the teacher's quarters. And the jelly beans in the corner, that's for, that's for little kids. With their rug. Oh, oh, let's go to the pub. The two flags. I'm still looking. I did have originally the tender Ron something. I haven't come across him again yet. Um, you need something, so I've got somebody at the bar. But it's Ron. It's just a random settler. Um, but you got a pool table. I thought using the vault bits would be fun just to give it a little bit of variety um, and then upstairs you've got another place to stay so there's plenty of if you come and visit sanctuary there's plenty of places to uh, rent a bed for the night uh, can I get through the doorway though <laughs> jump okay it's a high step um, so making little bedrooms in here very simple I could decorate more I've just done the basics at the minute. Uh, bathroom. And then you can get out onto the roof because it's always useful being able to get out onto the roof in case you need to shoot something. <clears throat> and let's not jump down there. Let's go on the hedge and then. Okay, let's go like that. To the last one on the block, Mama Murphy's house. Oh, I've got fireworks, but I don't know if I've got um Oh I've got weather chain shells there. That's a firework shell. Put that in there. I think it's in the miscellaneous uh firework shell. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. And that should fire straight away. I think. Apologies if sometimes I make you little Yep. It's all it's night time, but woohoo! <laughs> right, Mama Murphy's house. Again, it's a work in progress. I've got her there. She can I'm afraid she can I'm not her. much use in a fight anymore. But back in the day, folks mm -hmm. used to call me Murphy the Mad Woman. Murphy the Mad Woman, okay. <laughs> yeah, so needs her house doing because it's really bad a bit sad but um yeah one i've done the roof but i need to do the interior so it's all out ready oh there you are cod hey codsworth may i accompany you sir well not right now but not now codsworth i see sir another time then 
Yes, don't be too sad. Well, at least Mama Murphy's got a bed in there. <laughs> so yeah, still a work in progress, but it's um, I'm pleased with what I've built here in the country so far. Uh, let's see if Felix is. Hi, Piper. I'm very successful. Hey, pipes. How you doing? So, you know, going over it in my oh, head, that not again. whole conversation we had, where not I again. said you were my only friend. Did that sound? Yeah. Nice? Ooh, no, 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 no. No. I'm not gonna say it was nice to hear. <laughs> you just always know what to say, don't you? It's just been a long time since I've had someone like you in my life. No. Hell, might be I never did. I just wanted to say thanks. I really don't think I could ask for a better friend. Thank you. I'm not romancing. Yeah, we're best I friends. I couldn't agree more. You're the best friend I could ever ask for. Here's to many days filled with excitement. Yay! <laughs> again, for hearing me out. You're welcome. You want to get moving? Oh. Well, yes, but just uh, might might go out with Marie. Um, Felix, are you in your shop? You're in your shop. You've got a camera. I want to know if you've got a camera. You there know, you are. Since we talked, I'm feeling swell. <laughs> he goes over this every Look time. Two of us here in sanctuary, prepared, prepared for, for the future. future. Yes. Well. Hey. Now that you're back here in Sanctuary, how would you like a job? I always have to say this. <laughs> Stop. It cycles round and round. Just to make sure everyone filled out their forms. I was supposed to win a pack of steak knives. If there was a pack of steak knives out there somewhere in the world, you could get and what give... What have you got to trade today? Nice. <laughs> right, have you got an old camera? So it would be... Um... Just broken camera. I don't think it's frozen up. Um, doesn't look like he's got one. New. No. Not seeing one. No, not today. Never mind. You know what I call a good day? Okay. You know. Mm. I go right to the end. We've got Halloween stuff. Wall decorations, light under lights. There's a great big. There's a great big tree somewhere. No. <laughs> Just stick some decorations around. Um, yeah, on the clinic. If it'll go on the wall. Oh, it's kind of going through that one. Alright, let's try it on a wooden wall or maybe this. Oh, it'll go there, weirdly. It's hanging, alright. It's floating away. Some ghosts. Ooh! Can you put it on the fish No, that's a shame. That might be needs a ceiling. Let's Let's put in the clinic, is that nice? <laughs> I'm gonna put them in there anyway. <laughs> don't, don't think they light up or anything, but um <laughs> That's this where's this big tree? There it is. I think if he's got power. There he is. <laughs> Spooky tree. 
Uh, what else have we got? We've got jars of it. Oh, yeah. Special jar. I'm going to put that in the hospital. Need spare brain. Of course, it won't sit on the flipping surface. I don't know why some of these things don't probably, like, register as, as which is a shame. That'll do. What's this? Something else? Specimen jar. What is that? Fly or something? Yeah, it looks like a fly. <laughs> do they stack? Can I pull that towards me? They do stack. So what's that? Uh, that's a heart. Lovely. And what's this one? I... I... Is it fish or something? Yep, that's a weird looking fish thing. And then we've got... Good. Goodness knows what this is. What is that? Um... Halloween yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, folks in party chat still? Hmm? Yes, I am. Oh, yeah. I'm Belden. <laughs> Have you yeah, I'm still here. been in Fallout 4? It's Fallout Halloween stuff yet. Things in jars. Oh. Citation of some sort. Octopus. <laughs> Yeah, it's spoopy. What else have we got? We've got gravestones. We've got jars. We've got oh cauldrons. Ah, oh, this cauldron's pretty cool actually. It does take Nuka Cola Quantum, but I've got plenty of it. It actually bubbles. <laughs> Love that. Yeah, we could put some balloons outside. Um, what's that? I it's a crate, but I don't have one. Oh, it's just what? Those are in the Halloween tap. Uh, no, that's just the general decorations tab. But I accessed this from the Halloween. Specifically the Halloween tab, that's weird. Huh. Can I put those on the corner, please? Yes. There we go. Balloons. Um, let's see, you need to sell some pumpkins. Felix, Ooh. let's have some pumpkins on there. Uh, when you make pumpkins in 76, do you need a, to actually have pumpkins? A pumpkin, yeah, I do. Right, okay. Yeah. Just go to the pumpkin house behind there. Yeah, behind that's what I was <laughs> yeah. Right. He's got a little nod to Halloween y stuff there. There we go. <laughs> Right, folks, we've got just 20 minutes until the big stream kicks off on twitch.tv slash Bethesda. They're doing giveaways, various things, um, and they've got some surprises for us, apparently, so I don't know what they will be. I'm looking forward to finding out, though. Uh, yeah, let's uh, let's leave it at that for now. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to quickly because I don't want to lose what I've just done so I'm just going to pop that I say quickly, it, it's not that quick but excuse the blue screen for a sec while I just get that under my belt as I say and then uh, let's have a mosey because I can't remember what happened to Red Rocket let's go and have a look so that's my Sanctuary Hills that is, like I say, in progress oh, I'm still there because I reloaded again um 
yeah, it's cosy. I'm happy with the way it's coming out, and uh, it's nice to be able to show my little float off. So the VOD will be up for a while, and I will actually um, upload this one to YouTube at some point. I'm not uploading everything anymore to YouTube. I'm just uh, I'm just picking and choosing now. Um, yeah, I don't recall exactly what I had here. Now I might just... I've got a load of Brahmin apparently. Why have I got so many Ooh, Brahmin no. here? Where are you Eat all them. from? <laughs> Good grief, it's a Brahmin convention. <laughs> they've all stopped to um, fill up. They've stopped to fill up. <laughs> 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 For the milk machine. <laughs> Hi. Yeah, you can't milk these ones. Wows, there's, there's loads of them. I they don't... escaped from They, the, they escaped the, from uh, somewhere. I'm, yeah, I'm not able to go there with that one. <laughs> um, yeah, who's here? Settler. Oh, this is where I keep my bibbly bobble heads. And... Oh, we've got some Halloween decorations here. There's a spider web. Um, little bar. Farming is honest as honest work. Could the pumpkin house? Yep. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Got my magazines there. Oh, excuse me, Settler, can I go round you Ooh, like this? I can put all my dinosaurs out there. Uh, you can only... Well, I I put some in the shelter. I could only put three in. Hello, Red Rocket oh. Cat. Dinosaurs? Hello, person standing on the bed. Sprog, that's you. Standing on the furniture all the time. <laughs> Complaining about the bed situation. What? Why, how many people are here suddenly? Oh, Those good grief, they're all Brahmin! Really <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, this this is the place. Okay, this is the place I built up to get to 100% happiness. So it's not really exactly a proper settlement. I just plonked in what I knew I needed. Um, obviously, it's become popular. The, 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 so are they I'm saying that the Brahmin now need to have a bed? <laughs> Well, apparently there aren't enough beds. I think people have... I didn't switch this uh, this beacon off, did I? <laughs> this is still on. Oh, no, it is off. It's off. Well, how many are we talking about here? Um, 11 people, 11 beds. That should be fine. Yeah, it's this... Uh, I'll... It might be a bug, yeah. I don't know. Um, okay, did I see the Codsworth pumpkin with arms made from skeleton bones? No. No, where was that? Where can I squeeze a bed in? I can't really. Can I squeeze a bed in here? Excuse me. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll squeeze another one in next to this one. So we got. A Extra. There we go. Um, yeah, so that's that's a bit odd. In real life, someone made it. Oh, thank you. Yeah, <laughs> nice. Right, if I jump off here, am I going to go? Ah! No, he's fine. Yeah. He's fine. <laughs> he's absolutely fine. Um. I've got 20 minutes. Are there any settlements that you'd like to see? That's the wrong way to go. Far Harbour. Uh, I think I want to go all the way to Far Harbour. <laughs> I don't know. Somebody... Far Harbour. You want me to go to Far Harbour as well? Just checking. <laughs> <laughs> that's and Buddy Baby. Where do you want me to go? Far Harbour. What's the one that's near the castle? <laughs> near the castle. Like it's a little island. That's all. Spectacle Island. That's the one. That Spectacle. one. Should we go to Spectacle Island? Oh, I was going to go to Croup Manor after that as well. Hello, Mr. Mars, I presume. <laughs> Welcome to the chat. Oh, Beckett We've just got new voice lines. <laughs> <laughs> We've just got Beckett has new voice lines. Oh, he apparently mm -hmm. flirts with people properly now, doesn't he? Ooh. Yep. Yeah. Mm. Beckett, yes, I've got my. <laughs> I've got my, my pals from Lucky Ricky's Cats on the voice chat with me at the moment. 
Um, but we are going to we are going to uh, raid Bethesda's channel in about twenty minutes when they start up. So I'm just having well, a nosy around things. Is out of the question in here. Sneaking is out of the question. Oh, I can't get rid of that thing. Oh yeah, I did. I did do a lot of building here actually recently. Um, so not. I haven't done anything with this wreck of a house. I did try it once, but it it didn't go down too well. Um, and it has this one has turned out differently because I used to have like a a large sort of hut slash barracks over this end of the island, and then a a long long walkway over to the other end of the island, um, and then like a brotherhoody place. But I decided, well, I'm going to build it all in one this time so I built this massive edifice um, again yeah th this is just a little bit work in progress still I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna do with the rest of this shack whether I'm gonna completely dismantle <laughs> it or oh, whatever anyway huh? I was, I just put back in the later wasn't <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, I haven't. I haven't in seventy six. Haven't got the later hosen yet. Uh -uh. <laughs> no, 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 no. Anyway, no, that, that's, that's welcome, it. welcome to the Minutemen of Steels, the Minutemen of Steels, um, little fortress on Spectacle Island. So you've got to go in here because it says enter. <laughs> oh, you had a super mutant problem. Okay. Um, yeah, I still need to tweak the lighting a bit because it's a bit, a bit dim. So we've got the cafeteria here. So, you know, you get back from your patrol, you're hungry, you come straight here. Um, and we've got power armor stations, we've got a little shop area for clothing. We can go up the tower. <clears throat> right to the top, we've got a good view of things. Look at that view. There's the Pridwin. Um, I got that from the the Enclave um, editions, but uh, no, we're not going to call the Enclave, thank you. I don't think it works actually, I think it's just non-functional decoration if you build it mm. in a settlement, thankfully, because I, I don't want to, I don't want to call them, I think, I'm pretty sure we dealt with all of them now. Well, I'm not sure, I'm not 100% sure, because you might go and find that uh, there's more odd patrols spawn occasionally, I don't know. Um, I haven't found an armoury yet, there's nobody working here yet, but it's all ready for them when they arrive. Really good views o over the island. It's a bit foggy at the moment. There's cats everywhere. <laughs> I keep putting cat balls down. <laughs> Um, this is quite fun. The target. Let's see if I've got a weapon. Ooh. No, let's not use that one because I've got, um... Actually, I don't know what I can use inside, but... Uh... Can I use a nail gun? Difficult to get a nail, sorry. Difficult to get nails. It is, actually, yeah. Just use Reba. I'll use Reba, okay. Yeah. Wow, that's so loud. Is this not turned on? That one's not loud. Oh, all right. Well, you're supposed to shoot it and it switches on. Mm. So that turned round, but... Uh, I didn't disconnect it from anything, did I? Uh... Switch. Reset this hits. is so. This is very loud. I, I don't know. Let's try something else. Um, to reset the hits, I think. On the switch. Reset the hits. How? <laughs> well, it's just it's on zero right now. 
thought you were just supposed to shoot it. It spins. Well, it's supposed to go to. Oh, it goes to one. There you go. No, it was on nine before then. Yeah, you shoot it, and it counts. Yeah, that's on two. Yeah, so that does work. Um, well, the sun is pretty much up. Yep. A weapon shop. So there is usually a person here. I don't know where they've gone. Maybe they're in... no, they're not in their bed. They're somewhere else. Um, speaking of beds, we've got a bunk room. Residential. I like these flags. You just go through them. <laughs> you just push them aside. That's what you're doing. Um, push them aside. And the Brotherhood ones are weird because you, they're invisible from the other side. Um, I think the Minutemen ones, yeah, I think the Minutemen ones you can see both sides of. Why did that settler walk in backwards? That was really strange. Yeah. Doing the, doing the moonwalk. <laughs> doing the moonwalk. You okay? Yeah. Um, I've got a little weight bench there. Nice views again. Um, yeah, so just little little bunk room and then downstairs through here we've got a little exercise area a clinic if you need fixing up let's we'll be on. back in a minute that's good okay don't be so hear anything what's new doc been out of the loop lots of sick and injured yeah. taking I never tend to say anything now yeah. if you need treatment let me know to do with uh, yeah i think they did intend to do something on didn't happen. No, never mind. Not interested. Let me know if that changes. Okie dokie. Will do. Yeah, so... Clinic there and... Uh, what else have I not shown you? I think that's it for here, really. Oh, downstairs, yeah. Downstairs is a whole other area. The kitchen, for a start. Why is the basket halfway in the floor? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Fallout. Oh, never mind. Anyway, yep, so we've got a little kitchen there, I've got my generator. Um, it's the only cheerful place in <laughs> Chemistry stations for research centre. Numbered lockers for the scientists. Um, yep, screening so you can go through your decontamination. <laughs> somebody's oh no she's on my lap now I'm gonna have to leave that for a bit because I have a cat on my lap who's trying to trying to get at some food um, so yeah down here we've got a little greenhouse uh, <laughs> I'm your boss <laughs> it's fine Little greenhouse. Water purifiers and little office space. Somewhere to just sit and look. So I've I've gone with the, the whole Minutemen of Steel blue and orange um, motif. So McCready is a paladin major. And Vincent is the Sentinel General. Uh, so yeah, that's what I've done with my base here. Mm. Right, we might have time to go visit one more place. Any suggestions in chat? Where do you want me to go and visit? Far Harbour. <laughs> <laughs> do you want to go to Far Harbour? Shall we go to Far Harbour? It's a bit of a slog, but I can fast travel because this is on easy mode. No, that's the wrong button. I keep doing that 76 map. No, it's not. It's on oh, a bit Oh, I do. <laughs> All right. Where in Far Harbour? Pick one settlement in Far Harbour. We've got to go there first and then fast travel again when we get there.
Right. We are here. So, we, oh, I've done it again. <laughs> Which settlement am I going to see? <clears throat> We've got Old Longfellow's cabin. We've got, oh, I tell you what I have built up. Dalton Farm, I've actually built up quite a lot. Um, I don't think I've done Echo Lake Lumber very It's only got three people. Was that it? Was it just those three? No, um, the visitor centre as well. But I don't think I've done that one up much. Alright, I tell you what, I'm going to take you to Dalton Farm because I know that's the one I've built up most because it's got Hudson Manor on it. It is a bit spooky, it's posh here. Yeah. It is posh. I'm going to see if my... I can look at... Switch through my phone so I can tell if when Bethesda has started. Sorry? <clears throat> Another time. Um, right. Let's see if I can find that one. So they are, I believe, <clears throat> nearly ready. Okay, right, quick tour around here, folks, just for five minutes, and then we will go and raid. They do look like they're getting ready over at Bethesda. I would just ask people, um, when we raid, please don't spam the chat, because you might get automatically suspended from <laughs> um Yeah, one message is fine to say hi, but don't spam it. Right, so we've got a great big old house here. It's so dark. <laughs> um, let's go up this way. This is kind of the bat. Oh, don't be fighting already. What are you shooting at? That's a caravan guard. What are you shooting at, everybody? Oh, no. Good, because... No, Vincent, you're... Oh, come on. Condenser's down. No, I don't want to do that. No, I don't want to do that. No. Not a good time. It's not a good time. Oh. Get out of the way, Brahmin. Oh, my God. The golfer's bickering. Oh, where's the flipping... No. Maybe this is the wrong weapon. Maybe I need to swap over to it. Oh, come on, Liz. Ah! Gauss, thank you. Ah. I haven't played this in so long. It is a little bit different playing 76 to Fallout 4. And the combat is... it reacts slightly differently. No, not the second people. Yeah. Hey, kitten! My! Come on then, Vincent, just... Why aren't you so that... Oh. I yeah, wasn't doing it. Yeah. Oh, I'm right out of AP. Accept, no. Come on. Yeah. Oh, I missed. I twitched. <laughs> ah! Right. Oh, settle down. Oh, no, the fog crawler! Oh no, he's down. It's fine. It's fine. Completed. Help the farm. Talk to the people. Yes. Okay. 
Never look. There's no. <laughs> There's no take all. <laughs> Never mind. Um, where are you? Who I'm supposed to talk to? You're over hiding behind the tree line here. Hi. Uh, <clears throat> Thanks for the help. You're welcome. I'm glad I was able to help. We certainly appreciate the help, especially from a mainlander. Oh. Glad that's over. Yeah, me too. Right. Quick tour of the of the house. Oh, I've even got some names of people who have previously subscribed to the channel. Yay! <laughs> so, let's go um Let's go up here again. <clears throat> Right, so there's a little room here, a little guest room, um, let's shut that door, you wait, McCready's going to walk in behind me somehow, and we've got the little balcony, it's all suitably spooky, <laughs> um, down to the main hall there, but let's go it is a bit dark. Yeah, I can put my light on if you like. Okay. <laughs> We've got the main bunk room. All the uh, the basic things. Um, where's Vincent and McCready's room? Over there. Oh yeah, you have to go down the stairs, not the stairs again. Excuse me, madam. That's right. Vin and McCready's room is up here. He's got his bathrobe. <laughs> and this, I'm very proud of this window. It came out rather nicely, I thought. Oh, wow. Yeah. Bottle and Cappy, because that's their nicknames. <laughs> what do you think McCready's favourite What do I think McCready's what, sorry? Favourite settlement. His favourite settlement. Oh, I don't know, but it would be somewhere where he could get high up and see all around him. He, although he does, yeah, I, like a good sniper position, he does keep saying that he likes a rocky ceiling above his head. So, Vault 88, yeah, I think he might have wanted to move into Vault 88 at one point, but Vin was like, nope, can't do that. <laughs> Too claustrophobic. Um, to, Settlers keep sleeping in our beds. I just, I, I don't know what to do with them. Mac, what can we do with them? He's like, I give up. <laughs> Let's kick them out when we're ready. Shoot them. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, there's a little balcony. Um, send them on a mission that they're not going to come back from. <laughs> no, kick them out. They're almost anywhere in Far Harbor. Yeah. And they've got they've got some storage space up here as well. The children of Rassam were stuck up for a living for half. Yeah. <laughs> that was so good. Yeah, children of Rassam were. Four it was fun. Yeah, the the whole um, the nucleus was amazing, wasn't it? So yep, and you've got a little bar in here. I don't think I've named this bar yet. And you actually had tons of choices with the different Very It's like a parlour. Should call it tipsies. <laughs> Tipsy? No. I need something nautical. We've got a vim machine. Of course, you've got a vim machine, not a nuclear cola machine. Yeah, for Harbour. Something nautical. nautical. Something nautical, yeah. There oh, she blows. There she blows. <laughs> Actually, no, because oh. yeah, that can be taken the wrong way there. Yeah, and I, I'm, I'm really pleased with how the the liquor signs came out. I've sort of tessellated them together. <laughs> something so, nautical. Yeah. I like something I arms. Something arms. The gulper's arms. Yeah. <laughs> port side. The port side. The port side. Maybe. There's a little, little private parlour here. Yeah, this is this is definitely Vin's little spot. The fog crawl out. The, f the fog. The what? Crawl out. The crawl out. <laughs> Fall out through the fallout. 
Okay. <laughs> or something but angler since they want to. Yeah. Right folks, I believe we should go on to uh we should go on to Bethesda now, so I'm gonna hit raid. Right. Something's happening over on the Bethesda channel. Um Do, do, do. I just need to find them. That's that's my first channel. There we go. All right, folks. Thank you for joining, Vincent. And um, we're going to ride over to Bethesda. Go say hi and enjoy the rest of the stream. We'll be. I'll bring Vincent back at some point. Let me know if you want to see him again. Bye for now.